Man is dead after Mobile police shot him while executing a search warrant. This happened at a house on Charles Street. WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones joins us live from Charles Street. And Jeremy, you spoke with the family of the man fatally shot this morning. I spoke with his sister earlier to, uh, earlier this afternoon, and as you can see, I'm still at the home off uh, Charles Street as family members and friends have gathered to pay their respects to the one who was fatally shot this morning. Now, I spoke with the sister who tells me she was at home and she was extremely scared that her brother, who she's told us, 25-year-old Cordell Jones, was killed this morning. Mobile Police Chief Paul Prine says officers conducted a search warrant around 6 in the morning. His sister says the family woke up to the sounds of officers yelling, followed by gunshots. Her sister says his sister says there were seven people at the home. Police say the man now identified as Jones was attempting to leave through a back window of the home carrying a rifle. Now one officer then shot Jones, killing him. That officer has since been placed on administrative leave and her sit his sister says that her brother was did not have a gun when shot. Now, Chief Prine and District Attorney Keith Blackwood are investigating the case. You know, we will be transparent about the investigations. Uh, they will be uh, presented uh, in whole to a grand jury uh, for a determination on you know whether the, the shooting was justified or not. And tonight at 10, hear from the sister as she recounts the deadly raid that took her brother. Reporting live in Mobile, Jimmy Jones, WKRG News 5.